Why Anxiety Won't Change Your Future, The Wisdom of Alan Watts Did you know that no amount of anxiety can change the outcome of what's going to happen? As the renowned philosopher Alan Watts once said, no amount of anxiety makes any difference to anything that is going to happen. This profound insight can transform how we deal with life's uncertainties. Alan Watts, a celebrated British philosopher known for his work on Eastern philosophies and mindfulness, offers a unique perspective on anxiety that is incredibly relevant in today's fast-paced world. With mental health issues on the rise, understanding how to manage anxiety is more important than ever. In this video, we'll explore the nature of anxiety, dive deep into Alan Watts' wisdom, and learn why worrying about the future is futile. We'll also provide practical techniques to help you manage anxiety and embrace a worry-free mindset. By the end of this video, you'll have a new perspective on anxiety and actionable steps to reduce its impact on your life. Stay tuned to discover how Alan Watts' teachings can help you live a more peaceful and present life. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more insights on managing anxiety and improving your mental health. Chapter 1. The Nature of Anxiety, Defining Anxiety Anxiety is a natural response to stress, characterized by feelings of worry, nervousness, or fear about future events. It's important to understand that anxiety, in moderate amounts, can be beneficial. It can alert us to potential dangers and motivate us to prepare for important tasks. However, when anxiety becomes chronic or overwhelming, it can significantly impact our mental and physical health. Common Triggers In today's fast-paced world, there are countless triggers that can cause anxiety, work-related stress, financial concerns, relationship issues, and health worries are some of the most common sources. Social media and the constant influx of information can also contribute to heightened anxiety levels. Understanding these triggers is the first step towards managing anxiety effectively. Personal Anecdote Imagine Sarah, a young professional who constantly worries about her job performance, she spends her nights replaying conversations in her head, wondering if she said something wrong. This constant state of anxiety affects her sleep, her relationships, and her overall well-being. Despite her worries, she performs well at work, but her anxiety prevents her from enjoying her successes. Sarah's story is not uncommon. Many people experience similar feelings of anxiety, often triggered by everyday situations. Recognizing that you are not alone in experiencing anxiety can be a comforting realization. The Cycle of Anxiety Anxiety often creates a vicious cycle. The more you worry about potential negative outcomes, the more anxious you become. This heightened state of anxiety can then lead to physical symptoms such as headaches, muscle tension, and fatigue, further exacerbating the feeling of being overwhelmed. Breaking this cycle is crucial for improving your mental health and overall quality of life. The physical impact. Chronic anxiety doesn't just affect your mind, it can also take a toll on your body, Prolonged anxiety can lead to issues such as high blood pressure, heart disease, and a weakened immune system. Understanding the physical impact of anxiety underscores the importance of finding effective ways to manage it. Conclusion By defining anxiety and understanding its common triggers and effects, we can begin to see why it's so important to address it. In the next chapter, we'll explore Alan Watts' unique perspective on anxiety and how his teachings can help us shift our mindset. If you find this information helpful, please like, share, and subscribe to our channel for more insights on managing anxiety and improving your mental health. Remember, understanding anxiety is the first step towards controlling it. Chapter 2 Alan Watts Philosophy, Introduction to Alan Watts Alan Watts, a renowned British philosopher, was a pioneer in bringing Eastern philosophy to the Western world. 
He was a prolific speaker and author, known for his insightful and accessible teachings on Zen Buddhism, Taoism, and the human experience. Watt's ability to blend humor with profound wisdom made his ideas both engaging and impactful. Watts on anxiety Central to Alan Watts' teachings is the concept that anxiety is rooted in our desire to control the uncontrollable. He famously said, No amount of anxiety makes any difference to anything that is going to happen. Watts believed that much of our suffering stems from trying to predict and manage the future, an inherently unpredictable aspect of life. By constantly worrying about what might happen, we miss out on the present moment and create unnecessary stress. Philosophical Insight Watts' perspective on anxiety is deeply philosophical. He suggested that life is like a river, constantly flowing and changing. Trying to control the flow of the river is futile and only leads to frustration. Instead, he encouraged embracing the uncertainty of life, accepting that we cannot control everything, and finding peace in the present moment. Practical Application To apply Watt's philosophy, start by acknowledging your anxiety without judgment. Recognize that worrying about the future will not change the outcome. Instead, focus on what you can control, your actions and responses in the present moment. Practice mindfulness and meditation to ground yourself and reduce anxiety. Personal Reflection Consider a time when you were anxious about a future event, only to realize later that your worry had no impact on the outcome. Reflecting on such experiences can help reinforce the idea that anxiety is unproductive and encourage you to adopt a more present-focused mindset. Conclusion Alan Watts' teachings provide a powerful framework for understanding and managing anxiety. By embracing the present moment and letting go of the need to control the future, we can reduce our anxiety and lead more fulfilling lives. In the next chapter, we will delve deeper into why anxiety does not change the future, supported by psychological evidence and real-life examples. If you find these insights valuable, please like, share, and subscribe to our channel. Your engagement helps us continue to provide content that can improve your mental well-being. Stay tuned for more on how to manage anxiety and live a more peaceful life. Chapter 3. Why Anxiety Doesn't Change the Future Future Uncertainty The future is inherently uncertain. No matter how much we try to predict or control it, unexpected events can always arise. Alan Watts emphasized that our attempts to foresee every possible outcome only add to our anxiety. Instead of alleviating our worries, this need for control often makes them worse. By accepting that the future is unpredictable, we can begin to let go of the anxiety associated with it. Psychological Evidence Psychological studies have shown that anxiety does not improve our ability to handle future events. In fact, it can impair our decision-making and problem-solving skills. Research from the American Psychological Association indicates that chronic anxiety can lead to cognitive distortions, where we overestimate the likelihood of negative outcomes and underestimate our ability to cope with them. This distorted thinking keeps us trapped in a cycle of worry and fear. The Illusion of Control Anxiety often stems from the illusion of control, the belief that if we worry enough, we can prevent bad things from happening. However, this is a fallacy. No amount of worrying can stop unforeseen events. Instead, it drains our energy and prevents us from enjoying the present. By recognizing that control is an illusion, we can start to shift our focus away from anxiety and towards more productive activities. Case Studies Consider John, a man who spent years worrying about losing his job. He constantly imagined scenarios where he would be laid off and end up in financial ruin. Despite his worries, John performed well at work and was even promoted several times. His anxiety had no impact on his job security but did affect his health and relationships. 
John's story illustrates how anxiety fails to alter future outcomes but can have significant negative effects on our lives. Embracing acceptance. Accepting the uncertainty of the future is key to reducing anxiety. Instead of trying to control what cannot be controlled, focus on what you can do in the present. This shift in perspective can free you from the constant worry about the future. Mindfulness practices, such as meditation and deep breathing, can help anchor you in the present and reduce the grip of anxiety. Conclusion. Anxiety does not change the future, but it can significantly impact your present well-being. By understanding this, you can begin to break free from the cycle of worry and live a more peaceful and fulfilling life. In the next chapter, we will explore practical techniques to manage anxiety, inspired by Alan Watts' teachings. If this chapter resonates with you, please like, share, and subscribe to our channel for more insights on managing anxiety and improving your mental health. Stay tuned for practical tips on how to live a worry-free life. Chapter 4. Techniques to Manage Anxiety, Mindfulness and Meditation. One of the most effective techniques to manage anxiety is mindfulness meditation. Mindfulness involves paying full attention to the present moment without judgment. By practicing mindfulness, you can train your mind to stay anchored in the present rather than worrying about the future. Start with simple mindfulness exercises such as deep breathing or focusing on the sensations in your body. Apps like Headspace and Calm offer guided meditations that can help you get started. Living in the present. Alan Watts emphasized the importance of living in the present. He believed that by fully engaging with the here and now, we can reduce the power of anxiety. To practice this, try to focus on your immediate surroundings and tasks. Whether you're eating a meal, taking a walk, or working, give your full attention to what you're doing. This not only reduces anxiety but also enhances your overall experience and satisfaction. Cognitive Behavioral Techniques Cognitive Behavioral Therapy CBT, is a well-researched method for managing anxiety. CBT helps you identify and challenge negative thought patterns that contribute to anxiety. For instance, if you catch yourself thinking, I'm going to fail this presentation, challenge this thought by asking, what evidence do I have for this? And, what's the worst that could happen? This rational approach can help you break free from the cycle of worry. Journaling. Writing down your thoughts and feelings can be a powerful way to manage anxiety. Journaling allows you to express your worries and examine them more objectively. Set aside a few minutes each day to write about what's on your mind. Over time, you may notice patterns in your thinking and be better equipped to address them. Physical activity. Regular physical activity is a natural way to reduce anxiety. Exercise releases endorphins, which are chemicals in the brain that act as natural painkillers and mood elevators. Whether it's a brisk walk, yoga, or a gym workout, find an activity you enjoy and make it a part of your routine. Social support. Connecting with friends and family can provide emotional support and help alleviate anxiety. Sharing your feelings with someone you trust can offer perspective and reduce feelings of isolation. Sometimes, just knowing that someone is there for you can make a significant difference. Conclusion. Incorporating these techniques into your daily routine can significantly reduce anxiety and improve your overall well-being. By practicing mindfulness, challenging negative thoughts, staying active, and seeking social support, you can manage anxiety more effectively. In the next chapter, we'll explore how to embrace a worry-free mindset, inspired by Alan Watts' philosophy. If you find these tips helpful, please like, share, and subscribe to our channel for more content on managing anxiety and living a healthier, happier life. Stay tuned for the final chapter on cultivating a worry-free mindset. Chapter 5. Embracing a Worry-Free Mindset, Shift in Mindset The key to reducing anxiety lies in a fundamental shift in mindset. 
Alan Watts taught that embracing uncertainty and letting go of the need to control the future are crucial steps toward a worry-free life. Instead of viewing uncertainty as a threat, try to see it as an opportunity for growth and discovery. This change in perspective can help alleviate the anxiety that comes from constantly worrying about what might happen. Practicing Acceptance Acceptance is a powerful tool in managing anxiety. It involves acknowledging your thoughts and feelings without trying to change them. By accepting your anxiety rather than fighting it, you can reduce its intensity. Practice acceptance by recognizing when you're feeling anxious and allowing yourself to experience those feelings without judgment. Remember, it's okay to feel anxious, it's a natural part of being human. Success Stories Hearing about others who have successfully managed their anxiety can be incredibly inspiring, take Jane, for example. She used to worry incessantly about her health, fearing the worst with every minor symptom. By practicing mindfulness and acceptance, she learned to live in the present and significantly reduced her anxiety. Stories like Jane's show that it is possible to change your relationship with anxiety and live a more peaceful life. Letting go of perfectionism. Perfectionism is a common cause of anxiety. The belief that you must be perfect in all areas of your life creates unrealistic expectations and constant worry about failing. To embrace a worry-free mindset, let go of perfectionism. Understand that it's okay to make mistakes and that imperfection is a natural part of life. By setting realistic goals and being kind to yourself, you can reduce anxiety and improve your well-being. Gratitude Practice Cultivating gratitude can also help shift your focus from anxiety to positivity. Each day, take a few moments to reflect on the things you're grateful for. This practice can help you appreciate the present moment and reduce worry about the future. Keeping a gratitude journal is a simple yet effective way to integrate this practice into your daily routine. Conclusion, embracing a worry-free mindset involves accepting uncertainty, letting go of the need for control, and practicing gratitude. By adopting these principles, inspired by Alan Watts' teachings, you can significantly reduce anxiety and live a more fulfilling life. Remember, the goal is not to eliminate anxiety entirely but to change your relationship with it. If you found this chapter helpful, please like, share, and subscribe to our channel. Your support helps us continue to provide valuable content on managing anxiety and improving mental health. Stay tuned for more insightful videos and tips on living a worry-free life. Conclusion Living Beyond Anxiety Recap of Key Points in this video, we explored the nature of anxiety, drawing from the profound wisdom of Alan Watts. We delved into why anxiety doesn't change the future, backed by psychological evidence and real-life examples. We also provided practical techniques for managing anxiety, including mindfulness, cognitive behavioral techniques, journaling, physical activity, and seeking social support. Finally, we discussed how to embrace a worry-free mindset by shifting perspectives, practicing acceptance, and letting go of perfectionism. Final Thoughts Remember, anxiety is a natural part of life, but it doesn't have to control you. By adopting the strategies and insights we've discussed, you can reduce the impact of anxiety and live more fully in the present. Alan Watts' teachings remind us that the future is unpredictable, and no amount of worry can change that. Instead, focus on what you can control, your actions and responses in the here and now. Thank you for joining us on this journey toward a worry-free life. If you found this video helpful, please like, share, and subscribe to our channel. Your engagement helps us reach more people who can benefit from these insights. Leave a comment below with your thoughts and any techniques that have helped you manage anxiety. Stay tuned for more content on mental well-being and living a peaceful life. Together, let's embrace uncertainty, live in the present, and move beyond anxiety.
See you in the next video.